know, I think people define career and success, um, and you put those two words together a lot differently. And for me, you know, when I think of career success, it's what did we provide as a platform for the people that, that serve with us on our team at Signature Countertops. And you know, the first thing that comes to mind um, is when we were able to engage in an employee SEP program to where we could help match dollar for dollar uh, a certain percentage of what people invested back. And um, you know, again, for me, it's about providing a platform of longevity for those that, that serve with us on the Signature Countertops team. And I think that helps us do that. So something that people may not know about Chris is that while he is obviously a Marine, he served two tours of duty in Iraq, uh, combat tours, uh, what a lot of people don't know is that at the same time his first son Hayden was being born, he was involved in a roadside attack. Um, he's about 50 feet away from the explosion and by the grace of God, um, he wasn't harmed, he wasn't hurt, he didn't take any, any shrapnel or anything from that explosion while a lot of his unit members did. Um, and that was all happening simultaneously while his son was being born. So some of the things we're involved in, um, <laughs> it's kind of sporadic because we're involved in so many things. You know, I serve in a number of capacities on a number of different boards. The Building and Development Association of Southern Indiana being one of them. Um, I'm currently a Vice President of the Chamber of Commerce for Greater Scott County. Um, you know, collectively and corporately, um, you know, we're engaged in United Way Habitat for Humanity. Um, you know, we donate to a number of different things and, and um, you know, that's just something that, that's a passion of mine. But, uh, you know, we started a process uh, a number of years ago doing business with a company headquartered out of Austin, Texas. And uh, it just so happened that one of the owners of this company is brothers, is a brother to the two gentlemen that started uh, Yeti coolers. And uh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that being involved in the granite industry would lead to a relationship with uh, with two owners of Yeti coolers. But it's, it's just been so fun getting to hunt and finish with those guys. Um, but you know, that was a leadership uh, opportunity that we took our team to uh, and did some red fishing and some hog hunting and, and actually did some hog hunting out of a helicopter. Um, it was just an absolute blast. It was an opportunity for us to grow as a team and grow as a company. The next five years, you know, could take us a number of different directions. But for me personally, uh, I want to be part of a solution within the business community, helping to counteract the opioid epidemic we're facing today. And if I can do that, and if I can lead at some forefront regarding that, that'll be a small victory as far as I'm concerned.